Hi, I'm Jeff with DOA, Doorward Outdoor Adventures, and today I wanted to bring to you something that kind of completely wraps up my 2022 elk hunting season. As you know, if you've watched the video, you saw that my elk hunt last year was definitely a week long of a grind and came with a lot of difficulties, but in the end, I was successful. You might also remember that later on in December, what I had done, I had cut off the tines of my elk antler, made it into a keychain and a memento, and gave it to some people that have definitely impacted my life, along with a letter of appreciation. And after all that was said and done, I still wanted to do something else, something for myself. I have a shoulder mount of one of my elks on the wall. I have a Euro mount of another one of my elks and this one with me giving some of it away. I also wanted to do something for myself. So that's when I got in touch with my friend Jason from J Hook Customs to ask and see if he could build me custom knives. I had told Jason exactly what I wanted to do and that was to make the handle of my knife out of my elk antler and wondered if this was at all possible. Of course, Jason being a custom knife builder and creative genius he was able to make this work for me. I actually had asked him to make me two knives. I wanted one so that I could have right on my hip that goes with me on all my outdoor adventures but I also wanted one to display inside my house in case I lost one or I damaged it or I'm going to get it dirty in the field so I wanted two and I didn't want them to be exactly the same. Jason was wondering exactly what I wanted, but he's a follow of my channel, he knows what I'm about, he's watched my YouTube videos, and he was able to make a couple of very special knives for me. He was able to put together these completely 100% cost of knives done for me. Complete, he makes the sheath and all. Um, such, a, such a beautiful knife. Um, the elk antler in here, um, the tang, visible in one knife, um, hidden tang in another knife, so sharp, so sturdy, so durable. These are going to be absolutely amazing to use in the field. He's definitely incorporated my colors of orange, as you can tell, in the acrylics, both at the back of the knife and up near the front. He was able to even incorporate a little bit of a finger hold that he was able to grind inside there for me so that it fits my hand 100% perfectly. Um, the markings that he has done on the top of this knife are absolutely amazing. Um, such class of course. The logo that he has etched into the blade um, perfectly done. It fits my hand nice. It has the elk antlers here. Um, it's definitely a memento that will go with me forever. Once Jason was all done with the knives, he asked me what I was going to use to display the knife. And of course, I hadn't thought about it. So he offered to build me something um, which, is, which is great, that, that I admire. And um, it, it just brings it all together for me. So he used part of the elk antler where it kind of splits into the three tines from his one side here. And he's incorporated casings from ammo, but inside these casings, he has mounted knocks from arrows. So it combines my rifle hunting and my archery hunting all together with what it meant to this hunt. And although my elk hunts have all been successful with the rifle, I have spent many days in the bush chasing them with bow and arrow as well. So to have this mount and display piece to display one of my knives just brings more to it for me. It brings it completely full circle and that it represents what I do. I am so happy and proud of the way these knives turned out. They turned out exactly like I expected, even though I didn't know what to expect. They will bring me forever cherished memories of that 2022 elk hunt, whether I have one on my hip or whether I have one on display in my home. They serve as a memory to me and part of hunting and my outdoor adventures is what it's all about. Of course, wanted to thank you all for your support, for watching my videos, interacting with me in the comment section, and of course for subscribing. I love bringing you these episodes of my outdoor adventures, and I can't wait to bring you my next one right here on DOA, Doorward Outdoor Adventures.